the overlord of the Wala traditional area. Now for say the say the people the fourth was commanding President Ekufu Adu for commissioning the Upper West Virginia Hospital in passage of the bill to make the war campus of the University for Development Studies an autonomous university and renamed as SD Dombo University of Business and Integrated Development Studies noted a couple of concerns through his spokesperson. A hospital equipped with the most up-to-date state-of-the-art equipment. We could not have asked for more, Your Excellency. Your Excellency, most of the equipment are still sitting there covered, not just to protect them from the Hamatan dust, but from the lack of use. This situation, Your Excellency, is likely to be the case for a long time to come. If you do not assess the regional health director to recruit medical doctors to help put this extraordinary facility into full use. The presidential assent to complete the autonomy process of the work campus of the University for Development Studies and the upgrading of facilities and resources of the Polytechnic to enable it to meet the criteria for converting it into a technical university. President Ekufu Adu responded with shock and didn't understand why an autonomous status of the SD Dombo University of Business and Integrated Development Studies should still be an issue when he accented to the bill long ago. I'm somewhat surprised about the situation about the independence of the university. My understanding is that I've given assent to the, to the bill. Mr. Minister, am I right in saying that? Yes, I've already given my assent to the and in the same way, the upgrading of the Polytechnic to a Tesla University, that work is also ongoing. But I will also make an appeal to you. I've heard that for some reason that I don't understand, the authorities of the university have started transferring some of the uh, departments away from WA to other places. That has to stop. And I want you to take a personal interest in this matter and also engage the authorities of the university, that they have to stop it. Yeah. It, will, it will make a nonsense of the, the independence of the university if by the end of the whole transition period, key departments of the university are no longer present here. Then what would have been the point of making the university independent? We have to bring it to a stop. The Deputy Minister of Education is here with me and he will be liaising with you on this matter to make sure that the right thing is done by the new university. President Ekufu Adu then made three whistle stops outside the one house palace. The first was at Lima Irubwari where he called on the family of former Council of State member Ambassador Sanun Mokhtari who passed on late last year. President Ekufu Adu described the late Ambassador Sanun Mokhtar as hardworking, upright, and honest man who gave a great deal of his life to the MPP and the country as a whole. He also called on the new Upper West Region Chief Imam Al Haji Muhammad Kane before heading to the multi purpose Upper West Youth Resource Center, which is being constructed by Hapke Enterprise Limited. Consultants for the project, JK Hackman's Consult, paid the rate of construction at the site to about 72%. Reporting for the news, Rafik Salam. Wa. Wow.